The New York City mayoral primaries are almost here. And this year, ranked choice voting means voters can choose up to five candidates in order of preference. This means you can cast your vote in order of what's most important to you. I'm voting for affordable housing. I'm voting for our future. Me too. I'm voting for better health care, less traffic congestion on our streets. Heck, I'm voting for all of it. And I'm voting for myself. Because if you want to get things done right, you got to do it yourself, right? Right. Which reminds me, with ranked choice voting, you can even write in a candidate. Just make sure it's me. Hi, I'm Amy Wright, and I'm a real New Yorker. I like my bodegas cramped and filthy. I support small business, and I have no business getting a dog if my kid's allergic. I don't have a kid because I'm pro-choice, but if I did, I'd be a cool mom. Amy, I'm speaking. So am I. I've been breaking glass ceilings since kindergarten. When it comes to smashing the patriarchy, well, we should see the other guy. I fight for diversity and embrace all cultures. My favorite, cancel. I'm committed to real change. So New York, let's do it right. Okay, Amy, you can't do this. You tell me I can't run for mayor because I'm a woman? There are at least six women running for mayor. Huh. And with ranked choice, you can vote for at least five of them, which means you can keep your options open. Who doesn't love options more than New Yorkers? I do like keeping my options open. Now, well, is the ranked choice really that much better than voting in the good old days? I got this. Mr. Peaches, with all due respect, the good old days. You said you were concerned about congestion. <laughs> call, call, call me Paul. Paul, make me your first choice, and I'll cut congestion by nearly half by eliminating all street-level bike lanes and putting them underground. Get ready for subway cycling. New York's back, sign me up. Isn't that just taking your bike on the subway? Also, are you two related? That's ridiculous, one of them is bespectacled. Subway cycling is taking your bike next to the subway. See, I'm putting bike lanes and all that extra real estate between the subway cars and the tunnel walls. That's horrifying. Amy, you're gonna have to do this on your own time, okay? Whatever you say, nameless spokeswoman. Rude. With ranked choice voting, you don't have to limit yourself to just one candidate, Chris. Ranked choice sounds a lot like non-monogamy. I'd be interested in trying it. Trying which one, Christopher? Not now, Andrew. Christopher. Andrew. Speaking of changing the subject, Linda, you said you were concerned about affordable housing. Am I wrong or Amy right? I don't know who you are. Unlike some people, real New Yorkers know that owning a home here is pretty out of reach. She's right. We can't even afford to buy a house here on Staten Island. We live in Manhattan. What's in Staten Island? Here's the deal. New York City is riddled with big problems, and it all starts with zoos. Zoos are cruel and pretty lame. That's why I plan to shut down all zoos, releasing all those precious animals back into the great state of New York. Then I'll convert all that viable space into affordable housing for our families, our kids. <clears throat> so just to clarify, you want to shut down all the zoos? Yes. And then you want to release mostly exotic rehabilitated animals into New York State? Correct. Well, not the city, just the woods. And then you want to fill those empty cages with kids and family? Okay, well, when you say it like that, it sounds pretty bad, Linda. I'll just send out monthly checks. Well, I mean, that could work. I may be right, and when you're right, you're right. Who the F is running our graphics department? These, these are all extremely radical ideas. Yes, finally, someone making some sense around here. I was starting to think- and I like that. Can I vote for Amy in all five categories? Absolutely. Absolutely not. Absolutely not. A problem, vote for me as many times as you want. All right, sounds good. Hey, I need a pen. No, that's not how this works, and you're not even supposed to be here. Go off, nameless spokeswoman. You just earned my number two spot. I have a name. Wait, why am I number two? I'm not running. Oh, Paul's my number one, of course. Oh, yeah? Ah, oh, gee, come on. Son, you didn't have to do that. What? Ew, no, not you. Paul Rudd. Mm. Paul is my forever number one. No, really. I always vote for Paul Rudd. That's not even a real ballot. You know, this uh, new voting system is, uh, well, it's a little daunting. And, um, well, I want to thank you, pointless spokeswoman. Oh, it's nameless spokeswoman. For taking the time out to tell this old soul he's got another shot at making a difference. Oh, Paul, it's 
really nice. Thanks for saying. And that's why I'm voting for Amy's Nameless Clone. It's my number one pick. Vote A and C. No! Well, this sucks, Paul. That's Mr. Peaches. Oh my god, he's right. No, don't vote for me. She's a clone. This makes so much sense now. Does it? Mm, I don't know. The ugly one's got huge feet. Yuck. We're not clones. Am I the ugly one? You people are nuts. Amy's my sister. Now, what do you mean, you people? No, not you, you people. I meant them. Not because they're gay or anything. Oh, God. <laughs> you cancel. What? You can't just cancel me. Twitter says differently. Well, I don't even have a Twitter. Oh, that doesn't matter. What's a bean dad? It's an old vegan. Ew. What? Zoo lover, can I count on you? I don't know, are you gonna make any of these horrible ideas a reality? Okay, so you don't like my subway bake lane either. Let's forget about it. Wait, really? Just like that? Just like that. That's pretty cool. You can have my fifth spot. What? Oh, and I like your pin. Who do you stand with? Oh, I'm just by myself. No, I mean, what type of ally are you? <laughs> oh, uh, general, you know, general ally. All the good things, no Nazis. <laughs> <laughs> no take backs. Baby sis, you're up. What do you say? Oh, now you care what I have to say. Okay, well, you're three minutes older than me, so you can cut that shit out. And I say there's nothing that you could ever say to get me to vote for you, ever. Seriously, I'd vote for a deli sandwich before I voted for you. I like a deli sandwich. Not now, Peaches. Fair enough. No, well, I get it. You know what? Totally forgot to mention my big idea. <laughs> hey, Cap. Son of a bitch. You know I'm right. This is a toxic relationship. Yes. <laughs> now, what do you mean, you people? <laughs> yeah, that was great. You got it, you got it. Well, I feel like when I lit myself last time, my face looked like a little muffin. <laughs> <laughs> great, as long as I'm not a muffin, we're good to go. <laughs> Rolling! <laughs> Speeding! I love when you yell at me, it's great. <laughs>